running is great cardio exercise. Engare toko maha kare rata na tera yau. But I've managed to find an alternative to pounding the pavement on your own, and it's an international movement. Kore atu, it costs nothing, it's timed, and it happens ia raharoi i te waru karaka i te ata. And it's worldwide. Kote mahi tuatahi, he rehita mo oma paka. The first thing to do is to register for Park Run, which is free. You just enter your details and then print out your barcode. And that enables them to time your run every week and let you know the results. Welcome along, everyone, to an absolutely stunning morning here at Western Springs. Uh, it's, uh, it's, it's fantastic to have such a, a brilliant turnout. All right, kowai, kowai ananga kiriata. So who, who actually participates in this? Anyone and everyone? Everything. Anyone and everyone, everyone that, really. I mean, you'll see people here, they're arriving with their dogs, with their babies in buggies. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Old people, young people, this morning they'll welcome visitors from overseas, local visitors, and that's what it's all about. It's just being inclusive, and, and it's at every park run. Wherever you go in the world, you, you just take your barcode and you can go. South Africa, brilliant. <laughs> Sydney, woo! <laughs> so Gary, Hi. Huri here, turn around. Yep. You've got a number on here, Kotahiro. Now, Kōrero Kia Mata Pana Kitena. So, tell us about that. Yeah, so these are a milestone t shirt, and every 50, 100, and 250 runs that we accomplish, we get a t shirt. So, 100 runs? Yes, I'm up to 150 <laughs> nearly now. Wicked, that is too cool. And Britt, tell us about your story, why you keep coming back to this. Um, for me, it's getting out and about. I'm on chemo at the moment, so it's every second week that I can come out and do it. Um, and I'm also doing Round the Bays, so trying to keep fit for that and um, raise money for Bowel Cancer Society New Zealand, so. Both amazing. <laughs> awesome work. Three, two, one, go! Once a month, there are pace setters at the park run, which is a wonderful way to push yourself to a personal best. So in terms of uh, the park runs, we know that there's a couple here uh, in Auckland, around New Zealand as well. What has your experience has been overseas with park runs? Uh, overseas, so I, I'm very fortunate. I've only done, actually done one overseas, but um, two years ago, my family and I got to the, the UK and we, uh, we had the opportunity to run in Bushy Park, which is the the very first park run, which was just over 11 years ago in, in London. Um, where, so we, we usually get about 100 runners here. On that day, there were 1,200 runners at, uh, at a park in central London. and um, So that's the home, and it was fantastic to go there. But there's now um, a, a couple of hundred of park runs in Australia, and they're just slowly uh, spreading through the entire world. It's, it's fantastic. So Jacob, not the ahakwe i haramayai nei. So why did you actually start coming to Park Run? Some friends just told me to come along, and I've been hooked for, you know, just to keep coming back. Yeah. Yeah. So so why is that that you keep coming back? Um, it's every week. You know, it's the same time, same place. You get to beat your own times. There's a challenge. You race against yourself, maybe against others if you're a little bit more competitive. There are venues all around New Zealand now in 18 different countries, so you can do it kind of anywhere. So others have also spoken about the community aspect mm -hmm. of it, and that's obviously something you've mentioned and is a big part of yeah, the reason absolutely. to keep coming. Absolutely. Here at uh, Western Springs there's a strong community. People volunteer, people, um, you always see the same faces, you know, you kind of beat each other, they beat you, you, you know, you go for a cup of coffee afterwards, have a laugh, have a chat. It's, it's great. So why do you guys come to park runs? Uh, so it's mostly for the social aspect. Ch chat to people when you run past them or when they run past you. And afterwards, you get to talk to the people who run a lot. And you, you get training tips to run faster. You get recovery tips to stay injury free. Very, very cool. What about you ladies? Um, I come to beat my last week's time. Um, the only person you have to beat here is yourself, so you can just take it easy some weeks and try and kick it up when you're feeling good. You really do get that sense that it is just about you, eh? You know, it's not yeah, just there's no race. Yeah. It's just here for exercise and get some fresh air. Yeah. I think I saw one baby buggy. I've seen the kids running, but there was also a lot of dogs as well. Yeah, pets and dogs running. Yeah. yeah. Very cool. So in terms of the whole family aspect, how important is that? Oh, it's really important. You know, exercise is a 
big part of our lives and we hope that it'll be a big part of our kids' lives and encouraging them to join a community like this, I think is really positive for them. Very cool. And uh, Jo, you've got, um, you presented with something today? Oh yeah, I got my 100 shirt. Yeah, got it. <laughs> <laughs> but I just turn up <laughs> and run. <laughs> No reira e te whānau, ko tēnā te uma pāka, so that's our park run, and I've got to be honest, at the beginning, I wasn't really sure how this was going to go, but I had lots of fun, met some very, very cool people, and in fact, it's inspired me to start one up a little closer to where we live. So, if you hear of a park run, I recommend you give it a go.